Hi, Dr. Stoll here for Doc Sports, and it's getting late on a Friday afternoon. That is May the 5th, as a matter of fact, and so it's getting late, so and once again, a busy day, so going to get right to it for you today. Uh, no horse racing for you today, but a big card for tomorrow, for sure on that, because uh, the races start in less than 30 minutes uh, as I do this video, so not, I'm not going gonna, gonna to let that one go, but I will let you know they had another winning day yesterday, uh, so really on a, on a nice run, 60% run over the last uh, eight days. And so, but you have other things. Got a five unit play going in the NBA today. And uh, that's, uh, that's, uh, that's available. <coughs> excuse me, on a 10 and two run in the NBA, 29 and, tw uh, tw excuse me, 30 to 40 and 23 long-term. So really strong run in the NBA. So a five unit play there. Major League Baseball, the Cubs already had a winner today. So that's 15 and eight recently, but I still have two more plays going tonight. So those are available at the Doug Upton page at Doc Sports as well, passing on hockey. So we'll just let you know all that stuff. All right, let's get today's free play right now. Toronto and Pittsburgh. Now, chances are Toronto and Pittsburgh are pretty happy to be facing somebody different than who they've had to face this week. Blue Jays lost all four of their games to Boston this week uh, after previously winning eight in a row at Fenway Park. Pittsburgh had a tougher assignment having to go down to Tampa Bay. Uh, they lost all three games and were swept. Uh, both teams actually have even longer losing streaks because they lost last Sunday, even though not much thought was given to that at the time that it was going to be any big deal because both teams were playing well. Now, since scoring 16 runs last Saturday, Pittsburgh uh, offense has gone chilly with six runs scored in uh, in four games. Blue Jays have actually sc scored better. They scored 27 during their five-game losing streak. But here's the problem. They've given up 42 runs in the interim. Okay, The starting pitching has been bad. Bullpen's just been awful. Now, Friday night, you're going to see Chris Bassett going for Toronto against Rich Hill, okay, for the uh, Rich Hill for uh, Pittsburgh uh, on that one. Uh, Bassett has an ERA over five, but his record is three and three, and, and his whip you would think would be higher, but it's not. It's only 1.21. And the, the normally those things kind of go hand in hand, but in this case, okay, he's walking too many batters. He's walking a batter every other inning on average. Uh, even though he's only giving up just over a hit uh, for every two innings pitch. So what does he need to do? He needs to attack the tr the strike zone more, which is something he is not doing well at this time. So that's it's important, I think, for him to be able to do that if he wants to see his ERA uh, come down. Rich Hill, in, and in baseball years, he's older than dirt at 43 years old and probably is older than some of the dirt at many of the ballparks that he He's uh, going to uh, pitch in this season. He still has his wide variety of curveballs from different angles, uh, from different speeds, you know, different grips, how they break and everything else. Left-handed, which certainly helps. But yet in his last three starts, he's got an ERA of 208. So that's crazy, right? Uh, from that standpoint, guy that his age as a starting pitcher doing that. While I admire uh, Hill's guile, and like him, I'm left-handed, so I, I do admire it. Um, Toronto's averaging five. Point two runs per game against lefty starters, which is ninth overall in baseball. Bassett, last September, faced Pittsburgh twice, gave up one run covering 13 innings. And also, this is very important. He is he and the team that he's played for is 13 and 0 as a road favorite of minus 124 or higher. So in this one for, for the free play, I'm going to take Toronto minus the 135 for today's free play video over Pittsburgh today. Okay. Uh, so again, just let you know, five unit play, NBA, 10 and two run right now, set to go. Already got one winner, Major League Baseball today, looking for two more. You can pick up both picks for just 30 bucks at the Doug Upton page at Doc Sports. The West Coast Wise Guys play for today. I got it some, somewhere here. I uh, just had to scribble it down today. Take the Phoenix Suns minus the points against the Denver Nuggets tonight. So that's the free play from the West Coast Wise Guys. So this is Doug Upton for Doc Sports. I'll be back on Saturday, a little calmer, okay, trying to get this all said and done. So this uh, until next time, I'm out.